Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan. In this video, we are going to solve and understand one factorial and permutation combination based problem that is CN5 equal to CN4 plus CN6 over 2. This is one of the CAT preparation question. So let's get started. But before that, I will share one concept of CNR. What does it mean if someone is writing C and R. That means it is one of the formula of permutation combination that is NCR. It can be written like this. It can be written like this also. And it can be written in the same manner also. So formula is N factorial over R factorial into N minus R factorial. This is we all know where limitations on N basically if you will see n is whole number. Let me write here n is whole number means n may be 0, 1, 2, dot dot dot. It cannot be negative integer. Now second thing is what are the limitations on r? r should be less than or equal to n. r should not exceed n. So let's multiply the given equation by 2. Why? Because I want to finish this denominator. So let me multiply both sides by 2 and we will write in the standard method of NCR representation. Okay. So equation will be 2 times NC5 is equal to NC4 plus NC6. If NC4, NC5, NC6 are in AP, then also we can write the same equation. So language may be anything. NC4, NC5, NC6 are in AP, then we will write twice of NC5 equal to NC4 plus NC6. Let's open it by the formula. So 2 times N factorial over 5 factorial N minus 5 factorial equal to n factorial over 4 factorial n minus 4 factorial plus n factorial 6 factorial n minus 6 factorial. Now you can see n factorial will be cancelled out from both the sides. Now 5 factorial, 4 factorial, 6 factorial. So we know that 4 factorial is 4 times 3, 12, 12 times 2, 24. 5 factorial will be 5 into 4 factorial. So 24 times 5, 120. 6 factorial will be 120 times 6, 720. So let's put the value. So equation will be 2 times 1 over 120 into n minus 5 factorial equal to 1 over 4 factorial is 24 into n minus 4 factorial plus 1 over 6 factorial is 720 n minus 6 factorial. Now we will write n minus 4 factorial, n minus 5 factorial in terms of n minus 6 factorial. So is it possible for us? So yes. So how we can write? See n minus 5 factorial can be written as n minus 5 and decrement in n minus 5 by 1. So it will be n minus 6 factorial. This is how we will write n minus 5 factorial. And n minus 4 factorial will be n minus 4 take minus 1 so n minus 5 take again n min minus 1 so n minus 6 factorial. Now you will observe for each of the denominator you will get n minus 6 factorial. So let's put the value. Okay. So this term I will cancel also that will give us 60. So let's put the value. So it will be 1 over 60 times n minus 5 n minus 6 factorial. 
ओके इक्वल टू वन ओवर ट्वेंटी फोर एन माइनस फोर एन माइनस फाइव एन माइनस सिक्स फैक्टोरियल प्लस वन ओवर सेवन ट्वेंटी इंटू एन माइनस सिक्स फैक्टोरियल सो नाउ यू कैन कैंसल ऑल द टर्म्स विच इज एन माइनस सिक्स फैक्टोरियल इन बोथ साइड नाउ इक्वेशन इज वन ओवर सिक्सटी एन माइनस फाइव वन ओवर ट्वेंटी फोर एन माइनस फोर एन माइनस फाइव वन ओवर सेवन ट्वेंटी इट इज फ्री फ्रॉम फैक्टोरियल सो लेट एस रिजॉल्व now i will multiply as i can see the left hand side denominator is n minus 5 so multiply both sides by n minus 5 first so equation will be 1 over 60 is equal to 1 over 24 times n minus 4 plus n minus 5 over 720 now you can see 60 24 and 720 if i will cancel by 12 means it is divisible by 12 all the three numbers so i will divide by 12 or you can say multiply both sides by 12 so multiply by by 12 so multiply so it will convert 12 over 60 so i am writing 1 over 5 12 over 24 so i will be writing 1 over 2 times and minus 4 Plus twelve over seven twenty, so n minus five over sixty. Now take one over two n minus four to the left. So one over five minus one over two times n minus four is equal to n minus five over sixty. Take LCM now. So it will come out two times. n minus 4 minus 5 over 10 times n minus 4 is equal to n minus 5 time divided by 60 okay now let's simplify it so it will come out 2n minus 13 you will open simply the bracket then it will come out 2n minus 13 equal to 10 times n minus 4 into n minus 5 and left hand side also having 60 now this 0 and 0 will be over. open the bracket 6 times 2 is 12n minus 78 6 times 13 is 78 now if i will open n square minus 5n minus 4n minus 9n plus 20. Take all the terms to right hand side. So equation will be n square minus uh, 9n and 12n. So it will be 21n. Okay, and 78 plus 20, so 98 equal to zero. This is quadratic equation. Now we will use quadratic formula. Let's use n equal to minus b, so 21 plus minus square root of b square, so 21 square 441 minus 4ac, so 4 times 98, 392 divided by 2a, so 2. 441 minus 392, so it will be 41 plus 8, 49. So 21 plus minus 7 over 2. If I will take plus sign, then 28 over 2 14. If I will take minus signs, then 14 over 2 7. There are two values of n. So n is equal to either 7 or 14. This is our answer, but we will cross check it whether both values are satisfying the original equation or not. so let's check let me write here check check for n is equal to 14 first so equation will be let me write 
टू टाइम्स फोर्टीन सी फाइव इट शुड कम आउट फोर्टीन टाइम्स फोर्टीन सी फोर प्लस फोर्टीन सी सिक्स now you you will use the same formula so i will write 14 factorial over 5 factorial into 9 factorial 14 minus 5 is 9 14 factorial 4 factorial 10 factorial plus 14 fact factorial 6 factorial and 8 factorial okay if you will find out the value simplify then it the first value is coming out 1001 14 c6 is coming out 3003 this is your constant value 2 and this value is coming out 2002 so it is 4004 equal to 4004 that means n equal to 14 is correct now let's check for n equal to 7 so 2 times 7c 5 equal to 7c 4 plus 7c 6 put the value 2 times 7 factorial 5 factorial 2 factorial equal to 7 factorial 4 factorial 3 factorial plus 7 factorial 6 factorial 3 4 factorial no it is 1 factorial 1 factorial now if you will simplify then that value is 35 this is 7 times 6 factorial that will cancel out so 7 and this value if you will check 7 times 6 42 over 2 so 21 is it matching so yes 42 is equal to 42 that means it is also true so n is equal to 7 is also verified and checked so our results are n equal to 7 n equal to 14 i hope you like this video thank you so much for your support and motivation so far and please do subscribe my channel if you haven't yet done thank you